Hi everybody. Today we'll, we will try to learn how to do a video resume. My name is Kumar from the end and we will learn how to do a video resume. Resume is your identity and your gateway to enter companies or institutions. Today let us see how to do a video resume. First you will be sending a PDF document or an MS Word document of your electronic form, resume, you will type it, you will, you will have all the details and it will be like this in your hard copy. A copy like this would have gone to companies and uh, the same way you will be explaining it in the video resume. First of all, you should have lots of confidence in uh, talking in front of camera or recording or if you have a video call and things like that from companies, nothing scary. So let's start. Myself, my name is Kumar Swami and I'm taking my own resume as an example. I'm a Bangalorean, currently I live in Mysore city. I'm an assistant professor at Cresta College. I'm a MBA graduate with vast experience. I was born on 22nd December 1978. A. Nagaraj was my father's name, Indian, nationality, Hindu. Aga card number 9316378894821. Languages known as English, Hindi, and Kannada. I can also understand Tamil and Telugu. Domain expertise. Domain expertise is in corporate gifting. That is what I started working with. Market research, sales promotion, fast moving consumer goods, fast moving consumer durables, retail, sales and marketing, HR, training, administration, and placements. I'm an author of MBA Spanda Kumar Swami and self published through White Falcon Publishing. ISBN number is 9781631026973. Let me start with my educational qualification. 10th standard was at KSAE board, first class 1995. PUC was PCMB, I am a science student, pre university board, Karnataka, first class in 1997. BBM, Bachelor of Business Management. Specialization was marketing, Bangalore University from KKECS Institute of Management, 2002, MBA, Master of Business Administration, specialization was marketing and HR, full-time course, Bangalore University from College Regional Institute of Corporate Management, Banshikri Second Stage, Bangalore, Bangalore City, Euro passing was in 2004. Other skill sets and certification include I've done a diploma in software technology at BGSS Infotech. Courses done was Computer Fundamentals, MS Win, MS Office, MS Fox, Fox Pro, LAN. This was in way back 1997 and 98. This was for about six months. I've taken a test in proficiency in English conducted by CIEFL Hyderabad, November 2000. A drawing grade exam in KSEE board, Karnataka lower grade. My summer projects, industry summer projects include two months, a market study of coffee vending machine in hospital segment in Bangalore city. Company is Coffee Day, Amalgamated B, Coffee Trading Company. This was with the beverages division of Coffee Day. It was for two months. We have to find the potential where the vending machine is actually can be sold at hospital segment. Whether we get the required cups, is it profitability is there? Whether to find out whether profitability is there to install a coffee vending machine. This was the project all about. Second project again was MBA project one month, an organization study at ICDS Securities Limited, ICDS Securities Limited, Manipal Group. This was an organization study. You were entering your office and staying there, 
into office and learning about the organization structure, employees, functions and things like that. And the next project was my BBM project. Three months, a study of Hindustan lever, beverages, products, visa V, competitive brands at key outlets at Hindustan Unilever Limited, HUL. I'll thank Hindustan Unilever Limited for giving me an opportunity for doing a three months full time course, full time project with them. It was in 2000 where they gave me an opportunity, 1999, they gave me an opportunity to do this project. We have key outlets where they give maximum sales, where we used to go to these outlets two times because they were taking, uh, they were large orders. There were retail outlets only, but, but it was slightly larger outlets. We converted those outlets into super value stores of Hindustan Niva. This was a pilot project which was started in Hindustan Niva Bangalore City, and today it is, it is very famously known as super value stores of Hindustan Niva. It's a very, uh, these are also called as key outlets. Very special, very profitable outlets. Let me start my professional experience. I started working with Mayflower International, India's first corporate gifting company, started by Indian Institute of Management Alumni, Mr. H.K. Lingaraju. I thank Mr. H.K. Lingaraju for giving me an opportunity to work with, to start my career with Mayflower International. Initially, they, they gave me work where I used to go to Hindustan Viva market research projects, like for example, bloat level check reports of Dulex Green Label Coffee and Lipton Taza. Those days, there was a mechanical gauge. We used to go about 30 to 50 outlets per day, uh, going there and checking the bloat level air and uh, quality checks of Taza and Dulex Green Label Coffee, consolidated report and sending it to Hindustan and Viva background. Second, they slowly introduced me to do sales promotion. So, and Mayflower International was a proud supplier of corporate gifts to Hindustan Unilever. Anything sales promotion, like for example, mugs, pencils, anything free along with the regular product was supplied majorly from Mayflower International and uh, we used to supply it. So. I used to do packaging and uh, dispatch, delivery at, across India, Coimbatore and various places. I would really thank Mayflow International for uh, sending me across India for their works. I also thank Hindustan Ligur also because we are the third party organization for them. Then I learned about corporate gifting, t-shirts, cap and cheaters, gift items and things like that. So it was basically a uh, very proud feeling. So I learned about sourcing, how to take an order and supply. So I was, uh, this was became a strong, apart from FMCG, sales promotion and market research, this area also became a very strong uh, expertise, that is institutional sales. This helped me to join further Mitra.com. Earlier it was called as Mithra Designs Private Limited, uh, Indian Institute of IIT Engineers Startup Company. Way back in 2007-2008, uh, I joined them in 16 July 2007, and I was with them till 2008. I was a head of uh, institutional sales, offline sales. There were today Mithra.com is online, not India's number one fashion boots. In olden days, we started as an offline business where you take cup orders. Uh, mugs and uh, IAM t-shirt orders, institutional orders. I was handling institutional sales. I used to take bank sales from corporates and supply the same. Then this uh, corporate gifting strength again helped me to join Titan Industries Limited. I would like to thank, thank the Tata Group for giving me an opportunity to work for Tata's. I was a senior officer for institutional sales. Uh, I was handling uh, entire Karnataka and Goa. I was selling Titan watches, 3000 models, Tamish gold coins, fast track range, uh, gift watches, Titan I plus range to corporates. 
I would also like to thank my interests uh, on retail helped me to join Arvind Lifestyle Brands Limited. I was handling US Polo brand. I was handling a showroom in UBL Road, then in a mall, and then at carpet office. And I also was responsible for opening new stores of flying machine and US Polo at Chennai region. So basically I had a large team in the showroom. It was more of training the sales staff, selling the garments of US Polo, um, taking care of the entire outlet. It was about 1,500 square feet store and a much larger store later. So this was my retail experience at uh, Arvind Lifestyle Brands Limited. Coming back to my academic experience, I started my journey with MS Ramaya College in 2009, February. I would like to thank MS Ramaya Institution for considering me as a lecturer in teaching for BBM studies. I was handling all general management subjects, HR and marketing specialization area, and also guidance and motivating for students at MS Ramaya College, Bangalore City. After that, I went to RK Institute of Management and Computer Science for teaching and administration over there. And after that, I moved to St. Francis Sales Electronic City as Assistant Professor and Placement Officer, by where I was there from 2014 to 2018 for more or less about three, three and a half years, uh, teaching for UG students, BBA, Bangalore University and placements. I was also a placement officer there. I was, I was bringing a lot of companies to campus, motivating students, preparing them, finding your students to get jobs. And a uh, lot of uh, activities taking play, uh, taking, uh, place at uh, SFS College. Uh, my sincere gratitude to SFS College who gave me an opportunity uh, for, for three long years. Then I moved to Mysore City because I personally like Mysore City. I started my journey with St. Philomena's College, Autonomous Mysore, in the year 2017, where I was the marketing manager handling entire admissions for the college, for both UG and PG. Then my journey started with Mysore College of Engineering and Management, Mysore in 2018, as a training and placement officer. It is TPO, Career Guidance and Placement for VTO Engineering students. So I was guiding, motivating, and uh, taking engineering students to pool drive as well as campus placements. We had a campus pool drive, highest placements for about 4 lakh to one student and many other students were also uh, did well in the other placement activities. And next, I, I worked at DAV Public School, Dayananda Arya Vidya Public School. It is a CBSC school in Mysore. It is a top 10, uh, top 10 city, top 10 school in a CBSE school in Mysore City, where I was a manager handling entire school operations at, for the college, for the school. Currently, I'm, I am a pro assistant professor at Cresta College, Mysore City. And uh, I'm really grateful to Cresta for giving me an opportunity, considering my past experience and uh, giving me an opportunity to teach for Cresta students. Apart from this, I've taken many uh, market research projects for Hindustan Viva, uh, MPR Foods, Tata Salt, Tata Chemicals Limited. Worked for a franchisee store also called Ahad Retail, where he had uh, Belmont stores, Commercial Street, and, and Indranagar Outlet. Coming to my workshops, seminars, and TV orientation program and paper presentation and national level conference. Workshop, I've attended one. State level, I've attended one. National seminar, three. Faculty development program, two. Orientation program, one. Paper presentation, three. National conference, one. So this is a profile of myself students. Uh, this is what I've explained. I think I think I can send the same to companies also. Uh, this is a humble shoot of a video resume. It was quite lengthy because I happen to work in many places. As a beginner, you can shoot 
of your strength, weakness, opportunities and threat and uh, why I am suitable for your organization. You can uh, tell all about it in the video resume and uh, I wish everybody all the best. Let the video be short, interesting and full of learning and the other party like for example, I am sorry, like the companies or uh, whoever is viewing it should like the resume and should feel that you know this guy or this girl is fully potential to uh, hire so he or she should hire you successfully and it should be a two-way win-win situation all the best students good luck thank you bye bye